Christians all over the world observe Easter as the Holy Week, which marks the resurrection of Jesus Christ and a somber observance of the Holy Week, marking the events that led to his arrest and crucifixion. Good Friday is a more somber day where many people pay homage at their respective worship centers. Our correspondent takes a look at how some Christians in the nation's capital marked the Good Friday. Our report. Good Friday commemorates Jesus Christ's crucifixion. Some Christians observe the day by fasting and attending church services or reenactment of Jesus Christ last hours. At the Federal Capital Territory, Christian faithfuls set out early for worship in their various churches. <laughs> is the significance of Good Friday to Christians. Good, Good Friday is the day who Jesus Christ suffer for me, suffer for you, suffer for everybody that we should observe because it's very important. Then, not that we should observe it alone. We must you know, repent from the sins. We must follow Jesus Christ because today he died for us. Everybody, not Christian alone. What message does the clergyman have for Christians who are yet to submit to Christ and worship in truth? I urge all Christians that we should come together and we should pray together. All the problems we have in the country, it's our hand. If you come together, if you pray together, God will perish all this uh, problem who is facing Nigeria. So I urge everybody, I ad advise everybody that you should come together to pray to God. Moving on, another clergy is calling on Christians to not only see Easter as the only time to draw closer to God, but to make it a lifetime habit. And if you have believed in the Lord Jesus Christ, I want you to go from here, knowing that the death of Christ will not be a waste of your life. The death of Christ will not be a waste of your life. What lessons can you Easter is one of the two most important seasons for Christians around the world. It is the joyful end to the Lenten season of fasting and penitence. <laughs> 